Hi, this is Dr. Dan Lorch with Teradan Clinical Trials. Diabetes is a big problem in the United States with the obesity epidemic that we have. It's estimated that perhaps one out of three people will develop diabetes during their lifetime. One of the big problems that we have with diabetes is diabetic neuropathy, which is where the nerves that go to the distal legs and feet become damaged because of high sugars uh, damaging the small nerve fibers over time. This leads to pain, numbness, tingling, burning. Uh, it can be a big problem. People sometimes have difficulty walking or it keeps them up at night. It's very common and in fact, it's not unusual for it to be the initial presenting symptom in diabetes where a patient will come in and they'll be having neuropathic pain without a diagnosis of diabetes and we diagnose diabetes as the cause. Uh, of course, diabetes is far and away the most common reason to have peripheral neuropathy. Neuropathic pain is different from regular pain in that it's actually pain caused by damaged nerve fibers in and of themselves rather than a intact nervous system reporting to the brain that there's a problem. Because of this nerve damage cause, uh, it's a lot more difficult to treat than regular pain in some regards. The medications that we have um, are largely a failure. There's a lot of room for improvement. Probably the best known would be uh, opiates, um, which don't work uh, in long-term chronic pain anyway, but they've led to a lot of problems which are well known with overdose, addiction, and withdrawal. The other neuropathy medicines that we have uh, don't work very well in general, and they also have their own set of toxicities, plus a lot of them make you very sleepy, et cetera. So we're studying new medications that are being developed for this problem that get around some of these issues. So if you're interested in participating in a clinical trial in one of these medicines, click the link below and fill out a survey and one of our coordinators will get back with you.